Hey there guys, welcome back. So today we're gonna try to catch some surf perch on the Oregon coast. And um, I have a new camera I wanna show you guys. This is the Castle Brave 7. And in this video, this is what we're gonna be uh, using to capture the videos um, for this episode. Um, it's a look, it's a camera that's cheaper than the GoPro, um, just a fraction of the cost. And so I took it to the, um, the coast just to test it out, see how it is. Um, and you guys can decide for yourself, okay? Um, again, Acaso Brave 7, it's got a very similar spec to the GoPro. Um, and it has a dual screen and uh, voice control, and it goes down to 33 feet and 4K 30, and uh, it, it does have a touch screen as well. So if you guys want like a cheaper alternative to the GoPro, but it takes uh, good videos, um, check out the Acaso Brave 7. When you get the Acaso, it comes with a lot of peripherals and other mounts and stuff. So that's really nice. And another feature is um, by default, it timestamps the uh, time and date in the upper left corner. So that can be turned off, but I left it on in this video. Right, so let's not waste more time. Let's get out on a surf and try to catch those uh, red tails. Hey, what's going on folks? PK here, welcome back. I got my friend Brian today. And we are here on the Oregon coast, and yeah, you guessed it, we're going to try to catch some surf perch. We are here bright and early, sun is not up yet. It is freezing, it's about 32 right now. Woo! So, we just got here on the beach, um, we're going to set up, and uh, hopefully they cooperate today. Alright guys, enjoy, enjoy the show. Alright guys, so for my bait today, I'm using gulp sandworms. These are really dry. They, uh, they're not like the original form like before. Um, they're, lit hard, they're much harder, so they stay on the hook really well. And you can fish with them over and over. So gulp sandworms, they're two inch size, and I have three of them on. And for my weight, I am using a two ounce disc sinker. And for my uh, leader line, I'm using a 12 pound test mono line. That's all there is to it. Um, that's how you catch these red tails. Okay, Brian, I'll make the first cast. Here we go. Oh yeah, there we go, finally. Oh my goodness. Woo. He's a little one though. Here we go, guys. First fish of the day. What are you? Silver. Oh, it's a little guy. Look at that. There we go, guys. Just a little red tail. There's the fish. He is about eight and a half inches. No, eight and three quarter inches. So let's let him go. And we are going to release the fish back into the water. And there she goes. Other way, there she goes. Wow, it's like no fish at all, guys. I caught that one. And it's been about 20 minutes. We've been at this for about one hour and uh, so far, no luck, just one fish. I don't know, oh, there's a hit. There's a hit. So far, Brian, I don't know how Brian's doing. Oh, there we go. Another one, guys. Finally. A little bit bigger than the last one. Let's see. Woo! No, he's not much bigger. <laughs> it's about the same size, actually. Okay, buddy. You're a little dude. All right. Well, all right. We're going we're gonna to measure you and let you go. Don't worry. Okay, buddy. You are about eight and a half inches eight and a half inches whoo you're a tiny little bugger okay let's put you back in the water we're gonna go to deeper water we're gonna let him go okay just like that there he goes there he goes wow double nice job man nice i got only little guys okay We'll keep those. Yeah, good, bad, right? good frying pan size. Yes. You get it on the gulp sandworm or the shrimp, huh? Yeah, I doubled up on the shrimp. 
Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So these guys right here, huh? Yep. Right on. And then this guy. Yep. Very cool. Not, not bad, right? right? Yeah. Decent. Yep, nice. Were you getting consistent hits? Yeah. Right in front of me. Right on. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of seals. No. No. Very, very few bites. Actually, the I'm getting this tiny tabs, kind of like sculpin. All right, guys. Just an update. We are coming in at 8:41, almost nine o'clock. So we've been fishing for about one hour and 40 minutes. Um, not a whole lot happening. I caught two small ones. Brian got a double, um, two keepers. So yeah, I'm not sure what's going on. It is a, uh, we just passed high tide. Usually we do well on this beach, but just to, this morning has been kind of slow. And well, that's how it is for surf fishing sometimes, right? It's never consistent. But anyways, um, at least we're not skunk. We're going to keep on going and uh, hopefully we get into them. Oh, there we go, finally. Woo! Reel and pause, reel and pause, guys. That's always been my method. I think he's a bigger one than, last, than the last two. Sorry, the first two. The first two were dinks and I think this one's a little bit, a little better. A little better, unless I foul hooked it. It looks like I foul hooked it. Oh, I foul hooked it. Oh, man. Yeah, poor guy. I foul hooked him. But anyways, there he is. 10 inches or more. So here comes the wave. And we are going to release him. There he goes. Just like that. There we go. There's another one. Woo, a little dink. <laughs> the uh, theme for the morning, guys, is uh, dinks. Nothing but dinks. Hey, it doesn't matter. I'm catching fish, having fun. Better than sitting at home. Yay. There, oh, yeah, actually, he's not bad. He's a little bit bigger than the other. Oh, he's going to fall off. Okay. All right, let's go measure him really quick and uh, put him back in the water. He is coming in about nine, nine and one quarter inch. Okay, nine and one quarter inch. Make sure they have plenty of energy to swim back. All right, so here comes the wave. We're gonna let him go. There he goes, just like that. Whoa, another one? Oh my goodness. <laughs> These guys, these little guys are voracious. This was about three minutes from my last fish. Man, look at this. It's a little guppy. Tiny little thing. <laughs> Woo! All right, here we go, guys. This is, I think this is my fourth. Fourth or fifth. And uh, not a whole lot of size to them at all. But uh, they're just right out here in the surf. Very close to shore, actually. Probably about 25, 30 feet out here in the sun. And uh, yeah, he took the top, sorry, the middle gulp sandworm. So kind of small, but you know, they're still fun to catch. There are bigger ones in here. As Brian just caught uh, two nice ones, so. But yeah, at least I'm not skunk, right? So let's measure him and uh, put him back. All right, there we go. He's released, there he goes. Huh? Little dinks, nothing but small ones. How about you? You got the two big ones. Okay. Yeah. I think I'm going to end it here because my uh, castle camera is almost out of battery. Okay. So this entire uh, uh, trip was taken with this uh, castle um, GoPro alternative camera. So you guys decide on your own how you like it. Um, but it's gonna end here because we're almost out of battery. Hey, Brian, thanks for coming, man. Yeah, we had a great time. Um, even though it's kind of slow, I'm catching a little dinks. Uh, you caught two nice ones. Yeah, so I'll put a link to Brian's channel below. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Have fun fishing. Tight lines.